What's up guys, Moritz here from Sections to Today. I'm going to show you today how you can install this Instagram feed gallery to your very own Shopify store. And I included it into one of my own. It's a software brand I own with a couple of friends and I'm going to show you in a couple of really easy steps how you can get this thing. First thing is going to be to download the Section Store app. You can find it in the Shopify app store. It includes over 100 fully customizable components and it's completely free as well. So you successfully got that boy, you're gonna head to the Shopify admin area where you want to find the app underneath the section store right here. Then you're gonna click on Explore Sections. And like I said already, the app is completely free. And also this section is one of our free ones. So you can get it for absolutely no cost. We do have a couple of premium sections, but this one is, like I said, completely free. So yeah, that's not gonna add any, any unnecessary code to your store and it's fully customizable as well. So. I think there is no better deal than that already. Let's head to the home area of the app where you want to be installing the whole thing to the dawn light theme, which you can do right here. And after you've done so, you can easily use it in the theme editor. And that's the one you saw in the beginning of the video. Just hide it. And we're going to start completely from scratch. So you're going to type in SS, Insta feed. And there you have it, that looks good. I'm just gonna remove a couple of those because we're just gonna use one row of photos for that. So that should be good. So you see it's already getting adjusted. And the first thing I wanna change is the background color. I wanna change it to that. We can put in a link of our Instagram right here. I'm not gonna do this for the sake of the video, just to save time. We can do join the movements, follow us on Instagram, hashtag, section store, looks nice, and there you can add your Instagram as well, which is going to be section store, it's all generic content, so at the end of the day you can just decide yourself how you want it, you can change the size of all of those little text things right here, and the handle is changeable as well, but we want to keep it a bit smaller, and the image padding is changeable as well, so it will have a little more room to breathe inside the whole thing and there you can add some custom CSS and padding to the whole block itself. Last thing is to just add photos actually and I have a couple of them right here so I'm just going to throw them in and we can directly link them to the Instagram. So let's just do that real quick. Throw another one in and another one and with the last one we are officially finished and that is going to be that one. Let's do it. That looks sweet. I'm just gonna steal the link of the other one from that section right here. Perfect. Let's copy that and throw it in here so you have an actual reference that the link is working. Looks good. We can just link it right here. Save it up. Get the main page a little reload so you can see what we've just done is all working and actually showing up. And if we click on it, the link is actually opening up and directly giving us the page of our Instagram. And that was pretty much it. I hope you guys found that useful, that little tutorial of one of our free sections. And if you did, always feel free to leave a like and a follow. And with that being said, have a good one and peace out.